Hi, this is George, and you're watching The Return of the King Channel. On the Jewish calendar used at the time of Christ, Shemini Atzeret ends at sunset on October 26th in Jerusalem. Over America, the moon will be visible in the sky above. It will be in conjunction with the King Star Regulus in the constellation of the coming King, Jesus, the Lion of the tribe of Judah. On August 21st, 2017, a total solar eclipse appeared over America. In the constellation of the coming king, Christ, the lion of the tribe of Judah. It too appeared in conjunction with the king star Regulus. This was the first of three eclipses to appear over America. The pass of the three eclipses formed the first and last letter of the Hebrew alphabet, the Aleph and the Tav. In the Greek alphabet, the Alpha and the Omega. In Revelation chapter 22, verses 12 and 13, Jesus said this, Behold, I am coming soon, and my reward is with me, to repay each one for what he has done. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. At sunset in Jerusalem, as Shimini Atzeretz comes to a close, the moon is in conjunction with the king star Regulus. The tribulation begins when the line of the tribe of Judah is found worthy to open the scroll and its seven seals. But before the tribulation begins, he takes his bride home. Paul in 1 Corinthians 15, 51 and 52 says this, Behold, I tell you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trumpet. For the trumpet will sound, and the dead will be raised imperishable, and we shall be changed. At the time of Paul, the twinkling of an eye was known as twilight, when day turns to night.